Hello, this is J. Radman playing Bard's Tale 3. Uh, we just, in the last session, we just finished exploring the Grey Tower levels 1 and 2, and so from here, we're going to continue on level 3. I don't know how tall these towers are. I seem to remember them being 3 or 4, but it'd be nice to kind of have a goal of finishing um, this tower this session, but we'll see. Sorry, I forgot to start my timer and now it's running. Uh, so to the south we can see, we can de detect, see is probably the wrong term, uh, a s something, a quiet, and another something. Uh, which those two, I think some things can apply to more than one type of effect. Uh, I think we've seen it be hit point drain and spell point regen. Anyway, they're down there somewhere. What we can see is a corridor heading off to the west. Probably the all, probably the whole length of the tower all four spaces over. Uh, there's a trap that way, I've decided I'm not going to try to perfectly map traps this, at least this dungeon. And to the north we see the same something and quiet. So they're, they're in these two spaces. Uh, what was I trying to do? Oh, the auto map also doesn't show any lines, so probably there aren't enormous numbers of one-way doors. So, this level's icy chill seeps deep through your flesh and sucks the warmth from your bones. It feels almost alive and malevolent. The dark miasma leeches your courage away and leaves you very uneasy. I... I'm okay, I'm feeling uneasy. An arctic mage, I'm feeling un uneasy about arctic mages, because I've never fought an arctic mage before. I will try the old pull him into ten feet and stone him to death. He summons greater demons. Oh, I meant to make it go slower, and I made it go faster. Okay. And my melee men uh, spell did not did not work. Uh, actually, let's have him. Let's her. Let's have her class preclusion, and. Uh, Lillian, who's slightly higher level, can try the melee men, which works. And they also managed to crit me. That's great, or not so great. Uh. And now time to put the party order back in place. I wish I I'd seen clearly what critted me. Probably was the greater demon, but I don't know that. It's one reason I tried to slow down the combat scroll speed, but I pressed the wrong key and sped it up. Oops. Okay. So along this column 
there's a spinner. Can we see it to the north? Yes. Okay. That doesn't narrow down that much. Here we have both a spinner and a trap. But when we look the north way, we can't see the spinner, which means it's here. Because the north way, you can only see one, two, three from the south. And when we look from the north way, we can see an odd, which means odd is, no, no, I'm clicking on this. There we go. We can see an odd uh, if I assume this is going to like spiral in or whatever, it means I guess we're going to walk on it soon enough. Nothing in the hallway. Facing south. Glacier golems and a jack frost. How far away are they again? 30 feet, out of range of a wither fist, so I'll just defend with my mages. I swear I feel like it's cheating when they cast spells and make attacks and advance the same round. Or I'd be okay with it if we ever got to do it. Okay, Golem down. No surprise that you have over 450 hit points. New loot, please. New loot. Oh, I just realized uh, no running spart bard song. Huh. Now I think I did find some one-way walls. I'm going to run from these guys while I try to verify my... It's interesting. Um, there are one-way walls now, but the auto map is no longer going to help me. I guess the training wheels are off. That or it's a bug. I like... I like to believe this is deliberate. I don't know whether the stairs are going to go up or down. I have to assume they'll go up. Okay, we can still see the spinner. And only the spinner. And the other way, we can see a spinner. Which could... No, it can't be this one. It has to be here or here. Um, because those were the spots where we weren't allowed to look because they were too busy giving us messages. And there's a something. We, okay, so... 
so the fact that I can see um, something facing west probably means there's a something here and a something here, or it could be here and here. Uh, for now, putting the marker there. Didn't mean to hit that pause. Okay, um... And we can see a trap facing east. I'll fight these. Mm. Polar bears, sleep mages, ice cream. These are these are uh, standard stuff. I'm attacking the sleep mages. Um, healing, hide. Pull those sleep mages in, please. Probably should have cast preclusion or something. I forget. The sleep mages summon friends or only cult mages? So pulling them in, of course, gave them an easier chance to use their group attack spells. But it also gives me an easier chance to kill them outright. And I think the polar bears are a bigger threat than the ice reavers. Is there anything left for my casters to do? I think no. Now I'm going for armor class with the bard, just to reduce the number of times they hit me, which I think there's some tipping point where I think that more healing per turn doesn't help as much. And I feel like there's another tipping point at the end where they aren't going to get another chan chance to hit you, so you might as well do more healing. I don't know. This may be flawed reasoning. So, flame sword, I don't need another one of those. They have like two in the bank. Flame sword. Drop. Discard. Okay. So there's only one one way wall. Hmm. And to the west we see a spinner. Something. Quiet. We see all kinds of stuff. I don't know how to... I don't know how to narrow that down. Or even how to record it efficiently. Okay. Uh, too many kinds of mages. I don't want to cut you spending that many spell points on melee men. Hmm. So my my earlier guess that the silence was here. Well, I think I just knew it was somewhere, and I think I thought it was either here or here. And now we have reason to believe it is here. And to the east, we don't uh, sense anything, but to the west, we do. So. That something must be here.
Oh, now we have another wall that appeared. For some reason they just, you know, want to skip one. Okay, so this, there are stairs here, but that makes me very suspicious. You know, like if if my goal, where are the, where are the stairs? Where's the stairs icon? Come on, where are you? Oh, way over there. Okay. If my goal was just to cruise up at the top, this is so easy, but then what is the rest of the dungeon? What is the rest of the floor for? I am too curious for my own good. So there's another quiet. So th th that's not supposed to be a stair. I don't know how I did that. Uh, where's where's the flower? Also, now I have to go upstairs and remove these false downstairs. Back. So it can sense a trap. Interestingly, though... Um, crap, I just put another stairway down because the stairway was still selected which means now there's going to be a false stairway no? no false stairway down here? oh, there is yeah, there is a false stairway so annoying stop, stop take it away and now I made one, I clicked too many times, and oh my god. Meanwhile, this floor got bumped, so please go back to where you're supposed to be. There must be some keystroke that does that, that I push accidentally. Use three... Mm. Anyway, the point I was trying to make before that travesty, and please select something other than stairs. Thank you is that looking north, we can see this wall, and we cannot see these. So, they, they must be one-way walls. So we got our one-way walls back. And we know where that trap is, so we can drop it now. Yet another one-way wall here. Oh, the other way. This way. Okay. Let's check behind us. One one-way wall here. What do we see to the east? Um, well, on the north side, and I, on the south side, we see a gap. And then what might be a doorway? Here. Definitely a wall here and a wall here. So we see. No guarantee that's what there is. Okay, I'm looking more carefully to the north. Uh, this is confusing. 
It looks like there's a one-way wall here. Maybe I didn't check behind me after every step. So that would imply there's a one-way wall there. And that this goes out. As does this, because I think I can see that from here. I'm gonna go north. And then turn and look east. We sense another trap somewhere. And there's a wall across. North of us is going to be a spinner. We should turn... Let's turn Sorcerer's Sight back on. Or at least Second Sight. Yeah, looking east, we've got a trap and a spinner. And something and quiet. I'm going to go north into this spinner and hate my life. Because it's also dark. So, a darkness spinner is kind of cruel. Because where are you going to come out? You can't use your compass, you can't use your vision. And... Watch what melody is going to work, is it? Nope. I guess I'm just going to randomly step forward. And then I'll turn left and right and find out I went north. Okay, well... This gives me an opportunity to check this supposedly one-way door, and yeah, it is. I went here and turned east, so... Okay, let's go back through the stairs. Back through the odd north. Um, recast our second sight. This time I'm going to go north and check behind me, first of all. Because I didn't know if that was a one-way door, and it is. Then I'm going to try east, and if there's a trap there, so be it. Okay, so... I can't really tell, because there is... I'm pretty sure a spinner. Where's, oh, where's Mr. Spinner? There you are. I think my guess that this was here was wrong, and it's actually here. I should probably go back to the armor song because I'm getting hit more than I want to. should speed combat back up because it's no longer one that feels really dangerous to me. Though these people do hurt. Well, I don't know. Are, gle are golems people? Or are they just machines? Racism in disguise? You be the judge. Sorry, I'm channeling Terry Pratchett. Um, or channeling 
trade practice editor or something. I don't know. Okay, I think, what way do I think that is? I don't know. Uh, if it was north, I would expect to not see that wall here. Same true for west. And if it was east or south, I thought there was going to be a wall there. Which way did I go, please? I went south? Okay, so I don't really know how I thought there was a wall from this perspective. And I was not a wall from this perspective. What about if I turn around? If I turn around, there is a wall. So... Perhaps this is just a one-way wall this way. I have to remove those footprints from pressing the wrong cursor key. And to the west, we also have a wall that was not a wall from the other side. I think we are. I'm, I'm starting to doubt it. Two levels above, so the third level. One one pace north and two paces west. No, where we would think we are. Where I thought we were. Um, but this wall is a one-way wall. Why did I have this down as a door? It seems implausible. I think this is a... I think, I don't know, it feels like a... a typo. Uh, I might as well put in the outer walls I can see. I don't have them yet. If I look south... I can see an outer wall and this wall. I'm just going to step down there, even though I think it's going to force me to loop back the way I already came. Because going back around here it seems easy enough. East. So that worked well enough. Now we have more darkness. Uh, but this darkness is probably not a spinner. Oh, I pressed, I meant to press forward on the map. And instead, I pressed forward in the game. So I stepped in here, which is not what I meant to do at all. Because that could have all kinds of... It could be removing my sorcerer site. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I think it did. I think there is a odd effect here. Among other things. Or, no, maybe it just fell off, because, like, two spells are missing, but not all spells. OK, 
Okay. So the view south has us able to see. The west is a wall and north is a wall. So that means there was a one-way wall coming in from the west. It also means we don't have a lot of choice about where to go next. So we step on the silence. And I'm going to put the game in fast forward for a moment. No, no, no spell regen. No hit point drain. No, no mana drain. I don't, I don't know if, if there's a something on the square, I don't know what it is. But I'm going to step forward onto an odd. So our second sight isn't working for us right here. And it's a one-way door out this way, what about north. And it's one-way door out that way. Did I ever check whether this was a one-way door? Oh, well, I can see it. There's a wall here. So that means this is a one-way door south. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, I am pretty sure this trap is where I think... No, wait, I'm not sure. Well, there's a trap up there somewhere. Uh, also, I can see this is a wall from this side, so it's a one-way door, which is what I meant to check in the darkness when I moved to the east instead. So, stepping into the darkness, stepping out of the darkness to the north, and Bard Song, and Light. So, what do we see? I think I see a one-way door from the beginning of the dungeon, but I thought I checked for that. Hmm. I see some kind of wall. Let's turn left, first of all. Okay, so we can see right through to the left. So this was a wall from that side, and this is a wall from this side. And that's all I'm going to figure out for the moment. Uh, turning to the south. This is a wall from this side. And the east. I've hit a decapitator. I sure hope I didn't hit anyone. Here is the trap we were standing on. Here is a wall we can see, but probably will be one way later. Um, And we just figured out that this, this wall is one way two, of course. Is it always alternating? Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up, down. There's probably one here, but I probably didn't notice. Okay, um... There's probably a spinner right in front of us. Is that right? So we stepped forward on the spinner and learned very little because we're still facing the way we were before. I think.
there is a wall in at least one of the directions. Probably south. Uh, that's probably east. I don't know. This feels more like east to me because it's got a spinner and something. I'm going to step this way. Okay, so that was east. North has no wall from this direction. West is a wall from this direction. I think the outer walls, at least on this level, are reliably just walls. And south goes all the way. Uh, I think that's correct. So let's go down to the corner and then turn around north. Okay, yes, there's a one-way wall here. And then step over and turn back. Okay, okay, yes, there's a one-way wall here. Overall, my perception of this dungeon seems to be becoming consistent. Even if it's not a positive perception. <laughs> Uh, oh, I have to recast the second site. I'm really getting tired of the spinners because they make everything else hard. That's probably north. I wish I had a way to readily confirm that this was a one-way wall. I think I only can exit, this isn't a real proof, but statistically, it seems like I can head east. Actually, isn't that different? No, that is east, because it's open on both sides, and this was open on both sides. And that's a wall that I don't know where it goes. That's east. Okay, so this is a wall that has odd, which I think is south. And that I think is north with the odd. Do, do all of the walls that I can land on say odd? It's hard to know when I have a statistically significant sample. A spinner is near. No, that's west. Okay, so at this point we have four walls. I am here, by the way, and one of those walls is south and one of those walls is west. The south wall is definitely one way. The west wall is unknown. This is also one way. At this point, I choose to go north. I'm going to go north. Can I differentiate between east and west when I'm in the middle? Well, I guess that's not really the question. The question is, can I differentiate between north and south?
Okay, I'm definitely in the middle. That feels like it should be south. Is the and that's different. And this should not be south because this wall segment would be this wall segment and should be Oh, I should update where I am on the map. So I'm here in this spinner, and I want to go north because that's where I haven't been. If it was, if I was facing south, um, there, this wall segment on the left would be see-through. Yeah, it's inverted. So this must be north. So let's step that way. Uh, I guess I'll just start fighting these things. I don't think that's relevant to this square. I think it's random. Or maybe this square just says there should be some random fight here. I'd also believe that. So I guess one question is, do I really care about the state of this exact wall and whether it exists and whether it's one way? You can definitely go from here to here. I guess I don't really care if I've been everywhere and there was nothing essential that happened. Because if this darkness spot wasn't a spinner, I would just test the walls I expected to behave certain ways. Okay, so this is a wall or a one-way wall. South is a one-way wall north. East is a one-way wall east. Okay. Um, stepping north, there was a one-way wall to the west. This is, this is one spot where the, the wall is actually not there. I, that's like probably the one place I checked. Anyway, I've explored this level. I don't need to worry about the last little one-way wall. Getting back to the stairs will be straightforward enough if I don't just teleport out. Okay, and I, I think 
the time is such that that whole dungeon is going to be that, that level three is going to be a time unit to itself. I am uh, slightly disappointed. I was hoping to get through uh, the Grey Tower, but so be it. Uh, this is Jay Rodman playing Bard's Tales 3. Uh, let's, let's finish the Grey Tower in the next segment. See you there.